up buddy nerdigans this is the one and only packer girl 89 of nerdigans i get today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for centuria chapter one but before i get into this we are at war with youtube's algorithm and it is slowly but surely killing my channel and in order to defeat this algorithmic beast we need you to please hit that like share and subscribe buttons and because of course this channel let alone this video are not sponsored enough we ain't sponsored by Shueisha and nah, we ain't sponsored by Manga Plus. And considering how much we promote Manga Plus on this channel, it's kind of surprising, right? <laughs> but if you love what we're doing and want to help keep me, my adorable Will Bubba Kiyu, somewhere around here, and this operation literally alive and kicking, so we can keep bringing you more anime and manga content, whether it be news, analysis, or live reactions like this one, feel free to hit up our Cash Up and PayPal links are in the description box below. So... I'm really excited to get into this series. I'm going into it blind, but looking at the art, it's giving very, um, like, Vinland Saga-esque, which is good because Vinland Saga is, um, is ending soon. So it, it's good to have, um, have this kind of series up in here. But anyways, let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us today. My entire life, I've never had any anything valuable in my possession. Julian, you bastard! Ugh. To be a slave means you are cast out the moment you are born. You are completely denied any honor and personhood, and you are perpetually and violently controlled. Ooh, so this is a grand dark fantasy full of thrilling battles. Alright, this is... Okay, I see. Break the shackles and seek freedom. Alright, a new star rises in the manga industry, the first series we've been waiting for, and this chapter is titled A Hundred Slaves. Alright, Kuramori, I see you. This is awesome. I, I'm already down with this premise. I am. This, it definitely gives very Vinland Saga vibes. Maybe even to an ex- I know some people are going to be like, well, what about Berserk? I'm like, uh, nah, this is more Vinland Saga than Berserk. Owning anything, uh, wait, owning anything for, is forbidden, so you have nothing. Ooh, this is beautiful. But I will say this, though. Something that uh, Kuromori really needs to do is add a little bit more shading. Like, in the color page, the shading is great. I'm down with the shading. It works. Maybe, like, a little bit more shading could be used, Yeah. But it looks good. Like the scars on his on um, his arm is just amazing. Oh my god. But like when the waves look great and the owning anything is forbidden, so you have nothing. That looks good. But then when we get to the ship here, it's like uh, it could use just a teeny bit more shading. But other than that, it's great. A hundred slaves, our biggest shipment yet. Captain, are we really going through the, um, Alex zone? How many ships, um, have sun passing through there, you know? Those waters are cursed, I tell you. Ooh, that background is beautiful. Legend has it there's, uh, some kind of myth uh, mythical beast there and it, that it hungers for sacrifices. This does, yeah, this is very Vinland Saga. It is. But I look, dude, this is what happens when you use shading. That background with the storm and the, um sea serpent there it looks nice relax we're only passing by the edge of it quit spewing nonsense you superstitious fool um <laughs> i smacked him that area is so, so dangerous not even warships or pirates approach it this means no one to spot us it's perfect for our needs captain we found a stowaway hmm? uh, what should we do kill him and throw him overboard mm, yeah see to it Stop, he's just a kid. That's right. Um, quit your yapping, slaves. You know, I really hate bastards who don't use their heads. We left the harbor long ago and only brought food for my men and the 100 of you. We don't have any to share with the stowaway. I'll split my portion. Ooh. You're carrying a child, lass. Um, I'll split with the youngin instead. You can have some of mine, too. Um, mine, too, and mine. Aww. Um, a oh, bunch of good-natured fools. C Enough. I don't care. Just shut up. Um, do whatever you want. This is a waste of time. Welcome aboard. Guess you're slave number 101. Mm. But you got a pregnant slave here. Why didn't you sneak aboard the ship? I heard you can earn a living um, if you go to the continent. So I'm going to buy my freedom and live my own life. What about you? Oh, so 
so they're talking about um, indentured servants. Because with indentured servants, um, compared to slaves, indentured servants, you can pay your way to freedom. If once you earn a certain amount or when you, um, uh, when you serve a certain amount of, um, amount of days or hours or whatever, yeah, then you could, um, be free. So I can, I, I see he's trying to go for the indentured servantness. What about you? Um, you had no reason to cover for me, so why did you? No, no one treats us with basic human uh, decency, so we slaves value compassion. That's why we lent you a hand. Aww. You'll help someone for nothing in return? I don't get it. What's the point? It lets us maintain our pride as human beings. Ooh. Uh, my husband gave me this a long time ago, but I didn't have the money to maintain it, so it rusted over. Give it here. I'll polish it for you. Really? I'm just repaying my, uh, my debt for the meal earlier. If it's a simple blade, then I can restore it. So you know restoring? Where did you learn something like that? My mother so Oh! My mother sold me for a pittance when I was very little. My master was a blacksmith. Hey, that's useful. That's where I learned. Do go black. That was smart. I did all kinds of chores while covered in ash and soot all day. Oh, but no. Oh. He burned me with uh, heated metal rods if I made uh, even the slightest mistake. Ooh, and that explains the scars. When it seemed like he was finally about to kill me, I grabbed a nearby Kreidstead and cracked his skull open. So that's what we saw in the beginning. Damn. I've never been treated with compassion before. Not by anyone, not even my own mother. So I don't know the first thing about stuff like that. Here, I'm done. Ooh, be careful with it and hide it well. If anyone finds it, I'm sure you'll have to pay the price. Also, don't expose it to the salty sea air. It'll rust again if you do. Thank you. Hey, kid, what's your name? It's Julian. I'm Mira. Nice to meet you. Dude, this is nice. When will the baby be born? Ooh, oh no. Dude, she's probably going to give birth on this ship. Watch. Soon, it might be around the time uh, we reach the continent. Here, feel this. Ooh, it feels strange. It's moving. Yep, it's kicking because it's full of life. My only hope is that this baby is born safe and sound and um, lives a happy life. If I can have that one wish, I don't mind suffering for the rest of my life. Aww. Why would you go that far? Um, Julia, what's wrong? I'm not sure. My chest feels tight. My mother sold me off in this entire time. I thought that was normal. Now that I know mothers like you exist, it's really hard to bear. Oh, she gave him a hug. Aww. You grew up in this cruel world and it's um, been rough, I'm sure, but please don't despair. From here on out, I want you to know this. Even in a world like this, love and kindness do exist. Aww, this panel is beautiful, too. Because you have the black, you have the darkness, and then you have, like, this aura, this warm aura surrounding uh, Mira and Julian. This is beautiful. So I beg you, don't give up on your fellow man. The movement uh, felt warm. Mm-hmm. It's clean time, you damn slaves. All hands on deck. Can't you give the lass a pass? It's too, um, it's too rough on her body. If you don't work, you don't get food. I'll do both mine and Mira's work. Um, Julian, what makes you think you, uh, any of you have a say in this? Let me do the job. I can work a lot harder than a pregnant woman. How virtuous of you, damn piece of filth. But if you have, have acid, just know I'm going to kill you. Um, Julian, are you all right? Why are you... If you have a safe delivery, you'll be happy, right? So I want you to rest. Aww. Thank you. I don't need much, young, uh, youngin. Um, you're the oldest one here, so you should eat properly. If you collapse, our work will only increase. Here. Um, I haven't stooped so low as to accept food from a kid. <laughs> He's saying it's okay for you to eat it all. Aww. You can't sleep? I get nauseous if I lie down. Oh, God. I get more rest if I sit up uh, right and take it easy. Carrying a child seems tough. You're amazing, Mira. It's the first time someone's praised me so wholeheartedly like that. But I don't think I deserve it. She's probably going to die during childbirth. I could see it. I'm not as amazing as a, um, a mother as you think. Um, I had a, a son about your age. But he was killed. Oh, but he was killed by slave traders. He died while trying to protect me and my baby. Whoa! I'm a mother who couldn't save her own son. 
To this day, I still re um, clearly remember his smile. I know I'm a failure as a mother, but even so, my son gave up his life for this baby, so all I want is for it to be born safely. Ooh, that light shining. I'm telling you, she is going to die. I can't shake my anxiety, though. If my baby were born, um, were to be born into a world like this, would it even be able to find happiness? Um, parents mean the whole world to children. I could tell how much you love your baby, Mira. So I'm sure the I lo again, I love this this art where we get that warm aura in the darkness. It just it's so good. So I'm sure the baby who you love so dearly will find happiness. I'm praying for their happiness too. Oh, and he hugs her. Aww. Thank you. There's something I realized. A mother doesn't cherish your child just because she's a mother. When you feel a connection with another person, that's when you start caring for each other. That's got to be it. I could sense the bond between Mira and her baby. Because I was sold off by my own mother. I never once experienced that irreplaceable bond. You're supposed to have... Um, Wait. I never once experienced that irreplaceable bond you're supposed to have between mother and child. Maybe I'll never be able to make that sort of connection for the rest of my life. That doesn't, that thought uh, frightens me. The sun's gone. You can't see Jack now. You don't get food and, wait, the sun's gone. We can't see Jack now. You don't get food until you, you've completed all your duties. Put your back into it, all of you. Julian over here. Isn't it breathtaking? Look at the sky. Ooh, that is pretty. I wish this was colored. I wish the top part was colored. So, because... It would really give more of an impact. You could still have like the black and white on the bottom, yeah, on the bottom part of the page, but just having that color in the sky for the stars and everything, it would just give it an otherworldly feeling. I th I'm very curious what you guys think. I really wish that I really wish the top part of this page was colored. It just would have really gave it that extra oomph. And hell, even you know what? I'll say even the sky on the bottom, you know, the bottom portion of the page. Like if it's only like Julian and Mira and the shit that's black and white and gray. I think that would work really, really nicely. It would give it extra pop. Wow. Hey, Julian, I was thinking, um, if we're ever liberated and free to do whatever we want, oh, why don't we live together? It'd make me happy if you were by my side. Aww. I'll think it over. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Th that's so nice, though. Oh, he's snuggling with her. That's so cute. But, uh-oh. Captain, um, we're getting swept up by the current. We've been, uh, pulled into a load. Uh-oh. That can't be. I made sure we were on route that avoided it. We're nowhere near where the map says we should be. Something's trying to pull us in. Something that lives here. What, what do you want about? We'll be in the clear if we lighten the load. Um, we'll do it here. All hands on deck. Do you really need all of us for, uh, for ship maintenance? Don't be ridiculous. My crew's more than enough to manage this ship. Then why'd you call for us? Oh my god, you just stabbed him! Oh. No! Well, what are you doing? I told you scum who go about their days without a single thought in their heads. I despise them. The sick, children, pregnant women, the elderly. Run! You're a worthless bunch who can only do unsatisfactory work. I bought you all for a cheap sum. You are nothing more than defective goods no one wanted. But if there's an accident, that's a different story. Since you're on my property, I can exchange you for insurance money. Oh, that sneaky motherfucker. It's the easiest way to make a profit. Not even military ships approach this part of the seas. There's no risk of any witnesses at all. Get, get out of here. Uh, come on, use your brains for once in your lives. You're shackled. Well, where are you going to run to in the, um, in the middle of the sea? Damn fools. Kill them and throw them overboard. Duck kid, get behind me. Go find me or... Oh. <gasps> No! Oh, shit. Stop it. Go, uh, get to the boats. Oh. I'm impressed. Every last one of them protected the pregnant woman and the kid. Uh, well, I tried and failed, I guess. All of you are just scum. All of you are expendable. A worthless lot that would never amount to anything. Earning me some easy money is your best use. Go on, toss them in, um... Kill them and toss them in the sea. Uh, aye, aye. What? Captain, something is off. Um, I... I can't move my body. What? Raindrops? They're frozen in midair. What the hell? What? There's no way. Oh, 
It's the Kraken! Yes, it's the Kraken, and this is beautiful! Oh my god, I love this shading. This is everything. Ooh! Dude, that's a What the hell? Do you see? Whoa! It's not a Kraken. Do you seek my blessing? Uh, one, you must sacrifice a large number of souls. Two, you must sacrifice a pure love. I shall grant my blessing to the one who satisfies both, um, both these conditions. The first condition you have already fulfilled. The second condition can be fulfilled by either of you. What's going on? Therefore, the two of you must decide. One of you will be my sacrifice. One shall die while the other shall be blessed and obtain great power. What? What the, what the hell are you saying? What the heck are you? Who I am, um, who or what I am is not important. Um, why I take away, I grant it instead. I will aid the one who remains. Now make your choice. Which one of you will lose your pure love? You said the one left behind will be saved, right? Correct, my blessing should see them safe. Then I'll offer my life. Mira, you need to deliver your baby no matter what. Go and live a happy life. Oh, no, Julia, don't do it! I won't let this happen again. No! I won't let another one of my children... She called him her son! I won't let another one of my children die. Julian, I leave your new sibling in your care, okay? Stop! No matter what, I absolutely won't let anything happen to you. Please, I don't give a damn what happens to me. I beg you, so please be born and live. Live! Oh, the baby lived! She, so she gave herself a C-section. Oh. oh, she's happy the baby lived. Mira, it's a girl. I'll name her Diana. Oh, I love you both so much. She called Julia her son, though! Mira! I'm satisfied. Now state your wish. Wish strange shall emerge from the pits of your despair. What's happening? Damn it! I can't move. You're all just scum. All of you are expendable. I want proof. Proof that everyone's lives, that Mira's life wasn't a waste. Then you shall have it. Ooh! You may move now. Uh, whoa, Captain! What are you waiting for? Kill the kid and the monster. Get that damn octopus freak! It might uh, sell for a high price! Yeah! Down! Oh, yes! Julia got power! Yes! Captain, what's going on? I was granted the life force of a hundred slaves. Their power, their speed, their endurance, their reflexes, all have been combined and bestowed upon you! Dude, that is sick! Please wait a little longer. Ch charge your giant! Dude, I can see how um, this could be like a berserk. Yeah, this is very much a berserk beats Vinland Saga. I can fucking see it. I can see why people will, th will think that. Oh my god, this is sick. This art is amazing. The decapitations and everything. Thank god. <gasps> no! Okay. You let your guard down, you fool. I'll get the file laugh. Gah. Huh? What? Why am I still alive? Dude, you have nothing to fear. You should go without saying that you've gained a hundred lives as well. <gasps> what? He gained a hundred lives? What the hell? That can't be. Damn it. W wait, I'll split my money with you. I'll give you a third. That's quite a sum, you know. Uh, right? So help me out here. How about you think with that head of <laughs> How about you think with that head of yours? Ooh! You offered the sea something you held dear. If hereafter the sea will no longer bear its fangs at you. This boat will reach the shore on its own within a day. You need not row. May fortune favor you. Aww. My entire life. <laughs> I've never had anything valuable in my possession. Until now, that is. Aww, the start of a true life carrying 100 souls. This is sick! I hope this one better not get chopped. This is in Jump Plus, so I, I, I am not worried about it. I'm not concerned about it, but oh my god, this walk is amazing. Oh my god. Seriously. Like, 
people are lo I'm looking at the manga plus comments to see what they're saying. They love it. They love it here. This is a leg I agree with this one here. Legendary new CN and right in the making. Yes. Yes, I can see it, especially with Vinland Saga ending. This one I think will take um take uh where take over the um the void that Vinland Saga is leaving behind. I love it. This is amazing. Like everyone is is talking about <laughs> I was thinking this too. Was, was that Cthulhu? Was that Cthulhu? That's a great question. Um, but it's just so amazing. I love this. <laughs> so god, Juliana Chain. <laughs> Juliana Chain. But yeah, there's uh, someone pointed out this is why I'm like, okay, I can see the berserk element in here is because of the um what happened on the ship um is very much like the eclipse and berserk. So yeah, this is very berserk meets Vinland saga. I like this. I, I really like this a lot. This is going to be good. Um, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think. Um, what you guys think of this series so far. Do you guys think this one will escape the axe? Like, compared to some of the other ones that we've seen in Jump Plus, I think this one will survive. I, I do. This one is just way too good not to. Like, seriously, Hasano? AKA the uh, um, editor in chief of uh, Jump Plus. So you found your Vinland Saga here. You found your Berserk here. That's what this is. And I'm very pleased with this. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdy Ginzig. Love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more uh, Centuria content. A few ways you could do that donate to our Cash App, PayPal, Patreon. Purchase something off our Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, fr uh, friend us on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.